There are numerous accounts of cats surviving falls from seemingly deadly heights. Some have been reported to survive falls from as high as 32 stories with only minor injuries. A cat reaches its terminal velocity after 5 stories. Terminal velocity essentially means that the object, or in this case cat, has reached a maximum free fall speed. So how are these cats surviving falls higher than 5 stories? In 1987, a study was conducted with 132 cats whom were brought to a New York City veterinary clinic for high building falls. 90% of the cats treated survived and only 37% needed emergency treatment to keep them alive. Even though 10% didn't survive, it is still remarkable that 119 cats in the study were able to be returned back to their homes. A few observations and assumptions were made through studies such as this. It was found that cats have aerial riding reflex which means that when they fall, they naturally turn feet facing down. Why is this important? When a cat falls feet facing down, it is able to absorb the ground shock far better resulting in fewer injuries. Fortunately for cats, they have multiple joints in their legs, so when they hit the ground with their feet, the force is dispersed more effectively when their legs bend. Their legs are also longer and act as springs decelerate them more slowly, thus reducing the seriousness of the collision. Furthermore, it is speculated that since cats spread their legs during free fall, they increase their surface area, which in return slows their descent by increasing the air resistance on their bodies. Even with natural selection aiding cats on their free fall descent, a cat who survives a fall from high heights is in short considered lucky. Nature might have prepared them for falls from tall trees, but falls from tall buildings is anything but astonishing. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe so I know to keep making more of them. Thanks guys! The legs are also longer and ah. The Furthermore, it is speculated that since-